Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us. I'm Barry Lowe, and welcome to News Channel 7 at 6. Students across the United States are getting ready to kick off their spring break festivities. Panama City Beach has been known to be a hot spot for spring breakers. That's why officials have several rules and regulations they'll be putting in place. News Channel 7's Jamilka Gibson joins us live at MB Miller Pier with more. Jamilka? Barry, several plans are in place to make sure that people not only have a fun spring break, but a safe one too. As thousands of people prepare to flock to the Emerald Coast for spring break, local law enforcement is gearing up. The goal is to come down here, uh, make great memories, and not leave with a criminal record. In Panama City Beach, a set of rules go into effect on March 1st. They include no alcohol on the sandy beach, no alcohol sales between 2 a.m. to 7 a.m., no digging of holes deeper than two feet, and no loud noises, including music. Uh, the rule of thumb is anything greater than 25. We can hear, you know, your music out of your car uh, for a distance of 25 feet or greater. Then uh, you can receive a citation for that. Um, also, I think um, riding on the exterior of a vehicle it is not safe. People sit up on the window ledges, sit up and through the sunroofs, um, ride in the back of pickup trucks, standing up. Um, you're not allowed to do any of that. To ensure these rules are being followed, officials say they're beefing up staffing and heavily patrolling problem areas like Front Beach Road. We hire officers all uh, over this county and throughout the state. They come and they fill in the gaps and they work side by side with us and we deploy them in areas where we expect to see maybe large amounts of traffic congestion or um, pedestrian gathering. Officials also have a message for parents to help protect their children. When you come down to the beach, capture a picture of them and their swimwear, uh, you know, what they look like that day. Um, record, you know, make sure if they have a phone, they have all the numbers that they need to call you. Um, you know, educate them. If they get lost, seek out a lifeguard or seek out a police officer or seek out somebody and, and, and tell them right then and there that they're lost. Once again, these rules go into effect on March 1st. Live in Panama City Beach, Jamelka Gibson, News Channel 7. Thank you, Jamelka. Beach Council members are also expected to vote on an ordinance that will close portions of the beach from March 15th to April 30th. Churchwell Drive eastward to Shark Lane will be closed from 10 p.m. to 4 a.m. each day. That's beach accesses 25 to 36.